and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my, me and my, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my, me and my kicks. What is going on YouTube? It's your favorite YouTuber, me and my kicks, and today I'm going to be doing one of my world famous mall vlogs. Um, when I went to SneakerCon, it was located in Schaumburg, Illinois, and there's a mall that I haven't been to in about like three to four years. It's called the Woodfield Mall. It's a great mall to be in, very big, spacious. They got everything from finish line, foot action, foot locker. It even got a consignment shop in there. So since I was in the area, I figured I'd do a little mall vlog of it. So you know, as I always do, I talk about the latest shoes that's dropped, give you my opinion on it. But as always, if you see a shoe that picked your entrance, comment that down below and we can chop it up in the comment section. Also, if you aren't subscribed to the channel, what are you doing, man? Hit that subscribe button, it takes nothing but a couple of seconds and you'll be notified of when I drop future videos. Make sure you follow me on all forms of social media, IG, Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter. I'm on all forms of social media. Now enough talking, let's get it. As far as kicks I got on feet today, got the Young Answer 4 Lows, the White Royal Blue Joints. Definitely have to bring out something different for sneaker time, man. Can't go. Out here at the van store, they got that Marvel Vans collab, so I'm gonna go ahead and check out the shoes. It's a nice little display though. I really like that. Got the Captain America, like what the joints. This is a nice little shoe. Then they got the Black Panthers. These so cold. These the best out the pack in my opinion. Got that little chain necklace thing as the Alex. I wanna say these what Deadpools? Maybe. Oh, if, don't get me wrong. Yeah, this Deadpool right here. Not bad. You got the Hulk. Little foot. It's not bad at all. Then they got Spider-Man. Marvel and Vans definitely snap with this collection, man. I can't even lie. They got the whole little merch set up. It's a cool little book bag right here. If I still rock book bags, I would get it. And is this a polo or is this a... No, it's a button-up. Yeah, this button-up is cold, too. Got the young little matching shoes. About to roll up in Foot Locker, see what they got going on up in here. Look like they got the tools already on display. I wanted to get these, but I think these gonna sit, and I should be able to get these with the swoosh shoe if I just wait, wait a minute. But they is definitely a nice shoe though. Got the Hall of Fame or Katrina 3 is up in here. If they got my sales, I'm going to go ahead and cop it, man. I've been waiting too long on this. And it look like they've been selling out every time I see them. So if they got them, I'm definitely going to cop them. A great shoe and definitely a must-have. Still got the Easter sitting here. Definitely a trash shoe in my opinion. You can already see, like, this patent leather is tweaking already. I don't know if this is a worn pair. This might return or what. But, yeah, this, this like, patent leather is looking horrible on it. These Kobe ADs just released, I want to say, a couple of days ago. I'm not really a fan of the new AD Wave. The old ADs was good, but these, eh, they're doing a little bit too much for me. Got the Kobe 1 Pro Trolls. I already reviewed that. I'll put it up above if you want to check that out, but definitely a great shoe. Got the Carry 4s in like a throwback Minnesota Timberwolves colorway. Not bad. Nice little playing shoe. I ain't seen these PG1s before. Nice little purple rain joint. Not a bad colorway. Way better than the PG2s, I swear. Speaking of purple PGs, I got the PG2s in like a purple colorway. I want to say these like commemorate an old Kobe shoe, if I'm not mistaken. But I still don't like the PG2 model overall, so I definitely got to pass on these. What y'all think about these Air Force 270s, man? I'm not really a fan of these, and they've been pushing out hella colorways. Like, it's doing way too much. Like, I like the 270 back, but I mean, this whole top, the strap, the got the laces like it's doing way too much in my opinion got these up tempos this is not a bad colorway when these came out i really like these like a nice little peppermint color or call it a candy cane joint got the all red arachis i remember when these first came out these were selling out very crazy then they got these elemental pink joints 
these better than the foams in my opinion. Nice little suede upper. Nice little shiny back. I like these. I like these real tall. Oh, they got some gold ones like that too. Gold with the beige front. Got some black ones. They got some like silver ones. Got the Easter Air Force One lows. These are right in my opinion, but I need to get these on sale like for like 80 or 90 bucks. I do like this colorway and all the pastel colors, but I can't pay retail for this. And retail is like 130, so they also got the blazers, which in my opinion was trash. Like they really Nike really fell off with the blazers, man. But if y'all like these, I love it, man. What y'all think about the blazers? About to head to Champs now and see what's going on. At that Foot Locker, they only had a size eight in those Hall of Fame threes. I figured it was just a one-off return, but let's check and see what this store talking about. They got felines right up front. That's different. Got this new colorway in the Air Max 270s. It's not bad. Got a little like glittery type uh, shoe strings. Not bad. Look like they got these sitting over here, the Jita 11s. I did a review on these. I'll put this up above if you want to check it out. But yeah, look like they got a nice little size run in these. This is my first time seeing the Climacore cool Ultra Boost up front. Not bad at all. I bet you these are pretty uh, breathable too. One day, if I can catch them on sale, I'm going to definitely cop them. Got the all white ones right here. These are probably the best colorway in my opinion. For 200, I cannot do it. I need them for lower than that. Nice little crazy color in the bowls. I ain't never seen this colorway before. I also ain't seen this one either. It's like a nice little like New York Knicks colorway. What y'all think about these colorways? Put that down below. They over here tweaking with the Paul George two colorways. These colorways is trash if you tax me, man. It's like, would you buy any colorway like this, man? Like, what, who would rock these? I can't see this, man. They they doing the Paul George two colorways, two bowls. Yeah, foot action. Let me go ahead and see what they talking about. Up close look on these Mellow 2s. Not bad, exactly what I expected. I'm definitely getting this when it goes on sale for that swoosh shoot. Look like the leather on point. And just overall quality, like it's pretty clean. Got these 2s that came in that pack with Converse. These decent, not bad at all, but it was just the fact that they made a 300 and they added those, those weak Converse's in there that made me not want to get these 2s. These red foam Air Force 1s recently dropped. What y'all think about these? This colorway, I'm not really too fond of. They should have just gave us more metallic red foams, real talk, because I remember when those came out, they definitely sold out. They still got these 14 sitting here. Definitely on my list to get on sale whenever they drop, but this definitely a nice colorway. Got these copper 11s that dropped not, not too long ago. This is a nice little pair. It's like it's a big size too, size of this. Size 11, this is the biggest size that they got. Not bad. Got the last shot, 32 lows. These just dropped today. Not bad. But I'll take the 14s over these any days. But 120, that's not a bad price. Want something to hoop in. Not bad. Here go these recently uh, released MJ jerseys made by Nike. As far as the quality, they okay. I'm guessing if you buy these, you can like get like special content and stuff on Nike, but they're like retail on these like 120. It's definitely not worth that price. About to check out finish line now, see what they're talking about. See this nice little display they got going on here. What shoe are they talking about? Looks like the Zoom Pegasus. Not bad. Then they got the matching little gear. It's not bad. It's a nice little display for the Reacts, Nike Reacts. It says Springy. Then over here they got like a whole bunch of feathers saying light. Then over here they got they got soft. And what's this one say? This one says long lasting. It's not bad. They got DMX just sitting on the shelves here. These was available on Memorial Day for 50 bucks. I would have pulled the trigger, but I ain't had no bread at all. They got the killer cams, killer cam joints that I grabbed. And I did a review on, I put that up above if you want to check it out. Definitely a great shoe. Then they got the navy and gum ones. These not bad either. Uh, definitely a nice little running shoe, or a nice little walking around shoe. They got the Champ uh, Curry 4s here, the black and gold ones. I wish these was on sale. I definitely cop these for a little discount. It's not bad at all though. They got the NYC 
of tempos. I wasn't really a fan of these, nor these Chicago ones. I wanted the ATL joints. Those are so cold, man. I wish I, I wish I could have got my hands on a pair of those. I like this color on the Air Force Ones, and I like how like the color bleeds into the sole like that, make it like a marbleized, nice little sole. That's not a little. It's not bad at all. Nice little thing. Got different little thing. Got different little sand on the back. All right, guys, that's the end of the vlog. If you like this vlog, hit that thumbs up button. Comment down below what was the best shoe you've seen in this vlog, and we could chop it up in the comment section. I haven't been to Woodfield Mall in about two to three years, and it was definitely great to just go back there and check everything out. If you ever get a chance to go to Schaumburg, Illinois, definitely check out the Woodfield Mall, man. Very spacious, got a lot of stores, everything from Lush to Foot Locker, Foot Action. To the microsoft store they got everything in there man but anyways if you aren't subscribed to the channel what are you doing man hit that subscribe button it takes nothing but a couple seconds and you'll be notified when i drop future videos and lastly peace